The ancient Greeks looked at the unknown of the night sky and called it cosmos, or universal order. I call this cosmos as well. The universal order within, just waiting to reveal its secrets to us. I think Milton said it best. To see a world in a grain of sand, and a heaven in a wild flower, hold infinity in the palm of your hand, and eternity for an hour. Myron? Myron? Terry, what brings you here? I just dropped by to see how the presentation's going for tomorrow's board meeting. Oh, and I, I brought those vitamins I promised. They said they're the best you can get. Well, you're the pharmacist. So how's the presentation going? I'm not sure. I thought I had it all figured out, but... What's there not to be sure about? You're succeeding where others, including huge pharmaceuticals, have failed. Goal Labs is the gold standard. And right now we're poised for dramatic growth. I'm, I'm giving you a speech. Uh, maybe we're not ready. I'm just not that excited about the future. I know I should be. Myron, you've got to take better care of yourself. You're working all the time. F frankly, the, the board is concerned. We're afraid you're burning out. Little ounce of prevention. The first speech was better. Don't worry, I'll be fine. You always are. You know, sometimes something small can be the key to something big. I was hoping you would go down to the store with me. I could use some help. Adam, you've worked enough this week. Dr. Nolan said your heart can't handle Bertha, any. I run three businesses and a farm. I think my heart can handle a little activity with my son. So how about it? Well, if you really need me, I will, but I've got a student government meeting, then track practice, and choir rehearsals, and then... Yes? <clears throat> a date. Can I borrow the car? I'll drive you and Mom home after we get some ice cream. Here, I'll pay for the ice cream. I'll consider it alone. So busy. Yes, he reminds me of someone, but I can't remember his name. Yeah, Adam. Mm -hmm. His name is Adam. Yeah, that's right. Thank <laughs> you. I'm going home now. Don't work too late. Hello to you too, son. Sorry. Mother. <coughs> Father. Bye. I swear if that son of yours were any less. Oh, busy. that reminds me. Hello? Hey, Dad. You're still there? Yeah. Another late night. Uh, I'm preparing for the board meeting. Are we still going boating? I hope so. Cool. I'll get the boat ready. Dave, uh, you know, there's always a chance I might not make it. But I will try. Don't worry, Dad. I understand. Bye.
Mom? What's wrong? Adam Wentz was a good man. He left a legacy of generosity and kindness that will always be remembered by those of us who were lucky enough to have known him. The question for us now is this. What legacy will we leave our loved ones and future generations? None of us know when we will leave this life or how. We could be called home by a heart attack as Adam was. Only God knows why these things happen. Ours is but to accept his will and find comfort that one day we will again be reunited. That it may be so, I humbly and sincerely pray. Amen. Let me know what I can do to help. been blessed with so many talents. Use them. Go on and make your father proud. I wish I could have done something. 